suicide key facts more than 7 lakh 20 thousand people die due to suicide every year suicide is the third leading cause of death among 15 to 29 year olds 73% of global suicides occur in low and middle income countries. The reasons for suicide are multifaceted, influenced by social, cultural, biological, physiological and environmental factors present across the life course. For every suicide, there are many more people who attempt suicide. A prior suicide attempt is an important risk factor for suicide in the general population. Suicide is a serious public health problem that requires a public health response with timely evidence based and often low cost interventions suicides can be prevented. World Suicide Prevention Day World Suicide Prevention Day celebrated annually on 10 September is organized by the International Association for Suicide Prevention and endorsed by the World Health Organization. The objective is to raise awareness of suicide, bring people together to share hope and to promote preventive measures to reduce the number of suicides and suicide attempts globally. World Suicide Prevention Day theme 2024 to 2026 The triennial theme for World Suicide Prevention Day for 2024 to 2026 is Changing the narrative on suicide The aim of the theme is to raise awareness about the importance of changing the narrative surrounding suicide and transforming how we perceive this complex issue. Changing the narrative requires systemic change. It's about shifting from a culture of silence and stigma to one of openness, understanding and support. It means advocating for policies and legislation that prioritize mental health, increase access to care and provide support for those in need. It means investing in research to better understand the complexities of suicide and develop evidence-based interventions. As a part of the campaign for WSPD 2024 to 2026 IASP has issued a call to action start the conversation This call encourages individuals communities organizations and governments to engage in open honest discussions about mental health and suicide By starting conversations we can break down barriers and raise awareness check in with a friend or loved one share personal stories and advocate for mental health resources and support services every conversation no matter how small contributes to a more supportive and understanding society by addressing these areas and working collaboratively across sectors we can create a more supportive and compassionate society where suicide is preventable and everyone feels valued and understood tips on how to open a conversation with someone you are worried about choose a good time and somewhere without distractions Use open questions that need more than a yes or no answer such as how are things i have noticed you don't seem quite yourself listen well and ask how they are feeling such as how is that making you feel avoid giving your view of words wrong or what they should do Ask if they are feeling suicidal and help them get the support they need. Do's and don'ts of safe communication. 
do report content that talks about suicide or self harm in an unsafe way online don't share or repost anything that mentions the method or location of a suicide as research shows this can sadly lead to further suicides instead focus on raising awareness and signposting to help do post sources of support and share stories of hope and recovery don't use language that could come across as judgmental such as don't do anything stupid instead actively listen and offer support do say took his her their own life or died by suicide don't say committed suicide as this suggests suicide is a crime conversations are a catalyst to deeper connections fresh ideas and a better understanding so do start a conversation as a tool to suicide prevention